let's move on. Dana went on a uh, hot box. And I watched that episode. Yeah, it was only like 24 minutes, but it was good. I liked it. It was fun. You know, I, one of the one of the most sad things I think for me is when Mike Tyson let go of uh, God his his co-host, the tall, uh, yep. really tall e- guy, something with Elin or something like that. But anyway, that guy was awesome. Yeah. And then like they just they fired him. I guess he wasn't good enough or the show got too big. And then they brought in like a, like an actor for a couple episodes. And I, I quit tuning in. I was like, I'm good. Like, if you're just going to fire this guy because you don't want to pay him more. Well, that other guy he was talking to was another boxer, apparently, right? Do you know who that guy was? No, no, no. I don't know who that. But I just meant, like, when that guy got fired, mm-hmm. the first co-host, they brought on an actor for a couple episodes. And I'm like, what is this guy doing here? Yeah. Like, there's no chemistry between him and Tyson. And then they got rid of him. And now I think it's just Tyson bringing in random people mm-hmm. to help co-host for a couple episodes or something like that. I don't know. Yeah. Eben. 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 That's his name. Yeah. That guy. Yeah. I should watch it more. I hear it's a great podcast. But Dana was on it, and he was talking some shit about Jake Paul. And, you know, if fucking Tyson and this other guy are sitting there, man, he's got hands. He's got yeah. hands. I don't know, Dana. And Dana White goes... This kid is a fucking YouTube kid. Like, mm-hmm. I don't care yeah. what you guys are saying. This guy he's fighting, Askren, he goes, he's actually fought world-class strikers. He's taken world-class strikers' punches to the dome. He goes, you're not telling me this fucking YouTube kid is going out there and beating him. They're like, Dana, he's got hands. Well, and he goes, I bet a million dollars that Jake uh, uh, Ben Askren wins. Damn, that's crazy. What do you think the odds will be for this fight? Oh, f- Jake Paul's going to be a fucking minus 300, I bet, dude. Are you shitting me? I'm putting money Dude, on Ben Askren. Uh, yes. Yeah. If, 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 I don't care <laughs> right? what Ben is, yeah. if, even if he's a slight underdog, I'm putting money on Ben Askren. Yeah, 100%. That's fucking bonkers. It's crazy. Really? They're going to put Logan Paul or uh, Jake Paul as the favorite? That's what I would assume. I don't know. I haven't seen any betting lines. Oh I'm God. sure there probably are some already out, but I would assume he's going to be a big favorite. That dude. would be wild. Because everyone, like, there's not many people giving Ben Askren a fucking chance in this fight. Which I don't get why. I don't understand. Like, dude, if Robbie Lawler couldn't knock Ben out, which, you know, credit to Robbie Lawler, he almost did. He mm-hmm. almost did. But if he ain't knocking fucking Ben Askren out, I really don't know if Jake Paul can. I mean, he can, maybe. I mean, on any night, anybody could probably knock of anyone course. out. Yeah. But it's just, I just don't know. I think this is going to be so much more competitive than people think. Yeah, it's a little bonkers, man. I just, I, a uh, million dollars, though. You really think he's going to do that? Oh, or you I think he was just so. talking a little shit? He's definitely just talking <laughs> shit. And then, you know, of course, Jake Paul claps yeah. back and he goes, let's raise it to two million, Dana. Okay, he goes, let's, let's do two million. I'll put two million up. You put two million up. W- winner walks away with four. Do it, Dana. Put yeah, your money but, where your mouth is, boy. Thing. Does Jake Paul not look like the kind of guy that would be like, oh, yeah, let's bet this money, but and if I lose, yeah. I'm not paying you. Exactly. <laughs> but I'll take your fucking money, yeah, Dana. Yeah, exactly. No, fuck you, dude. Yeah. I would never trust that guy to bet with. No. Not in a million no, years. No. Not if with it, my money. Just make, Dana, just make the fucking Amanda Nunes fight already, okay? Especially if Ben gets smoked. Uh-huh. If Ben gets smoked, make that Amanda Nunes fight. Oh, dude. Like, make it. I, I'm not kidding. <laughs> I, if if Amanda Nunez could go in there with Jake Paul and just obliterate the man, I would pay a hundred bucks for that pay per view, and yeah. I would feel so great doing it. Yeah, and I would be cheering on Amanda. I'd oh, be wearing dude. her lion shirt. Yep. I'd be making signs for. Her. Mm-hmm. Uh, I would you know campaign for her if mm-hmm. she wanted to run for president. Absolutely. I would do so many things if she went out there and knocked out. <laughs> Jake Paul, it'd be the best. I'd be your personal servant. I'm like, I'll be your slave. Just, yeah. you know what? Actually, just you go know what? please knock I'm this I'm actually kid just going to literally just sign my life over to you <laughs> because I love you that much. Yeah. So, yeah, that's funny. <laughs>